Do you know the way to find an A? Written by Dale Wildman, illustrated by Peter Sisson. Okay. A. Do you know the way to find an A? Just look in words like jacket and play. Though if you ask an aardvark, he may say, you can see an A most any old day. B. Can you spot a bee somewhere about? A bee might blend in a bit, no doubt. Losing his bee makes a baboon pout. A bee can be tough to be without. C. Now when it comes to seeing a sea, raccoons are as helpful as can be. Whether on the ground or in a tree, they use sea twice continually. Is there's two C's in their name. D, you never know where a D will be. It might duck behind a cottonwood tree or daydream beside a chickadee. Yes, a D is quite a discovery. E, it's not true that E is everywhere, but it pops up often here and there. It can even help a bear eat an eclair. Go ahead and ask him if you dare. F. When there's the F. There's the big F and the little F. Mm. When it's an F you want to get, a ferret can be your best bet. Just pet her fur or dry when wet. Don't fret. You'll get that old F yet. Mm. G. You can't get a G from a chimpanzee or from an ape or a monkey or me. But Gorilla will be glad to give you his G. But you've got to grow bananas to pay his fee. <laughs> You'll have your H when this hair is caught. It's the only way to get it, for it cannot be bought. Not having an H is not so hot. In fact, without an H, hot is not. I. The letter I is hard to miss. It's not in that, but it is in this. It shows up in every mother's kiss. Yikes, it's in this iguana's hiss. J. When a J is needed, we say hooray. It turns a bluebird into a blue J. It, a J helps jets and June bugs fly away. And what else could Get us from I to K. A kingfish can be king without a K. Can, can't be king without a K. Kangaroos and kinkajous would soon fade away. K Katie did too, I'm sorry to say. And a kitten with no K would have a very bad day. L. To lake, locate an L, you could plead with a llama. Should, we, should he stay mum? You can always ask his mama. Though if she won't answer either, it's no big drama. Because who ever heard of a talking llama mama? <laughs> M. If a cow knew how to take M from her moo, she could take it right out and give it to you. Still, there has to be something else you can do. With no M, a cow couldn't say moo, only ooh. And an orangutan is not a man, though he does have sort of a hairy tan. Plus an extra N you should nab if you can. But if he sees you, hurry. Make a new plan. Because there's an N there and an N there. Why does a possum begin with an O? When we all say possum wherever we go. That is something I'm, I'd sure like to know. If you ask me, that first O must go. Mm. P. You don't ever 
have to purchase a pea. The friendly hippopotamus has three. And with pure hippo generosity, she'll give you the letter P for free. A quail is quite the right source for a cue. But did you know that a quahog will also do? Don't ask any questions, just know that it's true. A quahog is the quickest when it comes to a cue and you. Hmm. R. You won't get very far without our trusty R when alphabet reciting or riding in a car. But if you golf with a burrow and he happens to make par, He'll present you with an R that is fit for a star. If you want the if you wanted the S from a shaky squid, you would first have to learn just where that squid hid. Then make a supersized opening bid. What happened then would depend on what that squid did. <laughs> T. A turtle has a T for you and one to spare. A tortoise, too, has an extra T there. Is there a difference between this, this pair? Both are slow, but the tortoise beat the hare. <laughs> you. Hummingbirds have a U in every hum. Their wings beat so fast they hum and then some. They fly forward and backward. They go and they come. It's unusual, unique, in short, not humdrum. <laughs> when it's a V you want to see, just call for a dove. She may walk up very slowly or swoop down from above. So move toward her carefully. Don't yell or jump or shout. The V you find and just might be signed to you with love from dove. To find a W, just set sail with a whale. It's a wise and wonderful way to get that letter without fail. It's true that you could order one if there was one for sale, but it's more fun to ride the waves that would then wait for W in the mail. It doesn't matter very much what anybody thinks. You can't expect to find an X to match that of the lynx. So wait until it's extra dark and he wants 40 winks. Then grab your X and exit before that lynx even blinks. <laughs> a yearling is a young horse between one and two years old. And you know, now know where the, that Y is without needing to be told. But promise now to keep this horse and never see him sold. For to have a horse you love, who loves you is worth more than any gold. Z. When you look and see a buzzard flying by across the sky, be positively positive. A Z is quite close by. And when you get your hands on it, why, give a little sigh. Our alphabet is done, and now it's time to wave goodbye. <laughs> <laughs>